So, Mr. MTC, uh, we understand that uh, police came with a search warrant uh, at Harvest House. What really happened? Yeah, I was called by clients to come and attend to the police who were searching. In, in fact, at first they pulled on off the whole area leading to the Morgan Shagrai House. So the whole area was covered with police officers. I think they had some four, four trucks, which were full. I think they were close to 200 police officers who were in uniform. I don't know if those who were not in, in uniform, I saw a few faces which I, whom I know. My encounter is so when I engaged them, they indicated to me that the, the intention was to search. So when I, I got here, they had finished searching and I inquired from the client whether they had a search, a search warrant. I managed to see a search warrant. It was presented to me by the client. Then I inquired from the police whether they had anything. The clients indicated that they were present when the search was being conducted and nothing was recovered. So I inquired from the police. They said there is no official communication which is coming from us. It will come from PGHQ. But I managed to talk to Chief Superintendent of Gomez who indicated that all the people who were whose vehicles were packed near the moment Church Chongrai House, they are free to go. So I advised members of the clients who were around that they are free to go since nothing had been uh, found by the police from their searches. They, I was told that they attempted to, or they wanted to search at the next building, the Robinson House. I don't know whether they managed to search because I didn't attend. What? Search warrant was indicating that they were looking for matches and any other subversive material which could be used to commit the crime. My name is Fatwa Ekletis, I'm the Secretary for International Relations for the Movement for Democratic Change. Uh, I was one of the people who were here at MRT House uh, today when the police besieged our headquarters with a search warrant to the effect that uh, they were looking for matches. Uh, it actually came as a surprise because we all know who the godfathers of Mashurugui uh, are. They are none other than those that are in Zano PF. Um, and Mashurugu is all known that is being commandeered from the top. So it's actually surprising uh, that the police um, acting of course in Kabuz with the regime uh, had to come and malign the movement um, and to associate the movement with uh, Mashurugu. But we are glad that nothing was found. Um, it's really unfortunate to think that this is a government that is talking about a new dispensation when they are going after, you know, our movement, you know, as if we are criminals. Um, I think the constitution gives us rights as citizens uh, to form political parties, uh, to have political rights, and I think the regime um, must be able to respect those constitutional rights.